Obarogbo revived the title of Iyase. He gave the title to his trusted friend from Ezechima in the present day Anocha local government. He was not a Bini man. His name was Ez from Ezechima. So, his, so for his name he was Eze. I believe that this particular interview will put the rest of our identity crisis. Our brothers in Delta, our brothers in the rivers, exactly this particular interview is what you all need to understand the history of the Igbo people with the Benin. The Igbo speaking people has never been from Edo. They have been Igbo people. So I asked my brothers in the River Rhines, I asked my brothers in the Deltas, where did you get your history from? Because this is an original history from the mouth of the Benin man. Watch and learn. Chief David Adebi, the Eshaba of Benin, gives an insight into the family greeting. Benin is a very distinct cultural society. When his own family greeting before, the moment the Yoba confer the title of Yase on you, you will drop your own uh, family and use that of the Yase of Benin. So every Yase that has reigned from the time this thing was institutionalized, we greet the greeting of every Yase, and that is Lao Yezi. You follow me? Lao Yezi. How did it happen? There was a period, a long period when the Yase title in Bini was vacant. Nobody occupied it for almost 50 years. When it was revived uh, by Oba Orogbo, are you following me? Yeah. Oba Orogbo revived the title of Iyase. He gave the title to his trusted friend from Ezechima in the present day Anocha local government. He was not a Bini man. His name was Ez, from Ezechima. So, his, so for his name he was Eze. So every Iyase after that man now greeted Lao Yeze. You follow? La Yeze. That is attributing the restoration of the title of Iyase to Eze. The man who came from Ezechima. So, that, to that extent, Iyase of Bini will greet Lao Yeze. The Ezomo of Ozebu has his own peculiar greeting. Because the original man who became Ezomo, first Ezomo of Bini, came from Ewohemi in Eastern Division. So every Ezomo lineage of family now greets Lao Gesa. You follow? So now attributing their ancestry or their uh, origin to the Eastern origin, La Gesa. So every Ezomo of Zebu, their descendants, their children greet La Gesa. That is how this thing dovetails to all the families in Benin. For example, in my own family, I greet Laohe. Laohe. Do you know why? Because my great great father's ancestors came from Uhe, which today they call Ife. 
with Prince Aramia to Benin. So when we greet now, we greet to reflect our ancestors, where we are coming from, Laohe. That is what every member of my family greets today. So this greeting in Benin also acts now as identification mark as to which family you come from. If five of you come in here now and greet me different salutation, I will know where everyone comes from. So that is where the greeting of